Hello there, I'm Nigel Mill. Welcome back to another episode of Elden Ring. Last episode, I went through some tunnels, I went through some caves, I went through some bosses. Just like always. And now, I am on my way to see Blackguard again. I don't know why he's here, but... Okay, let's see him. What are you looking at? Oh, you again, is it? Yes. Perfect bloody timing, actually. I got crab cooked up fresh. Nice. Hey, the the thing changes too. Uh, negation for a time, greatly boost damage negation for a time. So, so boiled crab is just superior. Boiled crab meat, prime specimen for plump and moist meat. True connoisseurs know how to keep over from over salting. Greatly boosts physical damage negation for a certain duration. Unlike the prawn sword, this truly is crap. Not that it matters, it's delicious all the same. <laughs> uh, the prawn is a lobster. Just so you know. You should probably know. Hey, there's something I should probably tell you. Yes? You heard of the dung eater? Yes. He's a madman. Has it out for everyone. Curses him. Goes round in his rank armor and all. You see him though. Stay well away. Well. I was in the same jail as him once, so I know first hand. He's a god forsaken monster. Not just some petty dog like me. How about the dog eater? He's a killer. Kills people and curses the souls. Does all sorts of shit to the corpses <laughs> to keep them cursed. Forever. He's the only. I ain't seen nothing more disgusting in all my years. I ever been more scared neither. Rooted to the bloody spot, while he did that to my friend. Ah, uh, so sad to know. Never met someone with a taste for crab I couldn't trust. You've got a real thing here, eh? And it's only getting better. Cool. Something that I noticed, the these things, I like, I very much like, because if I go all the way here, Millicent is no longer there, so she moves somewhere else. So this I like, like, even though I haven't been here, you know, aside from going here and then going all the way back to Leorna and then doing the quest there and then somehow Blackguard pops in here in the map. I like that. That gives me a sense of direction to where these NPCs are because in a Souls-like game, you know, like Elden Ring, the placements of the NPCs are... well, it's anybody's guess where they are, <laughs> right? Because they teleport in the most inconsistent spots and in the most random of places ever so I like it I like it Alexander is still there I don't know why maybe I should visit him again later but yeah I like that this is the finger maiden finger reader yeah so I need to comb through the map again on my own time and figure out where other NPCs are. But okay, Marika's tits. <laughs> you must be hungry. Tits. I love tits. Something that I love about this character is that he's the only character that curses. <laughs> he's the only character that says tits, fuck, shit, and all of that stuff. So that's pretty. That's pretty nice and unique. Anyways, enough about him. I am going to Auriza side two. This is probably going to be a short uh, dungeon because of the way the icon looks. I'm just basing my opinion off of that alone. <laughs> okay, there's the door. There is... Oh. Okay. Ah. More jars. 
Okay. So this is going to be a jar dungeon. Probably with big jars also. Do you explode? Yes. The... Whoa! The ones who don't have a red lid, they are the ones that explode. The ones that have a red lid, they, they don't explode. Got it. I know the difference now. Because I am so smart. Okay. Okay, there's a way down. There's a glove wart all the way over there. But I'm going with the stairs for now. There's probably going to be giant pot boys. It's probably. Because why not? Aha! It's a trap! It's a godforsaken trap! Right? It's it's a trap. It's it's a it's a trap. Illusionary wall. Oh, no! Woo! That song bitch. That song bitch. It's a trap. Where will that take me? Probably some area over here. Probably. How many runes do I have? Eh, not a lot. I mean, I'm halfway to leveling once, but... I can get 200,000 souls in... In 10 minutes. Or 5 minutes of my farming. Uh, do I want to... You know what, I'll finish the dungeon first. How about that? I'll finish it first and then go to whatever the hell he, it wants me to go. And blah. Ah, more of these. Jesus. Are they all going to be booby trapped? They are. What the hell? Okay, so there's two chest traps. What was that? Huh? These guys. You bitch. I missed. I did miss that time. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did not look around my corners. I need to look around my corners. Damn it. Six. I needed an eight. I think the other glove wards, the eight and the nines and the the other great glove wards are somewhere in this direction, I think. Because so far, in these ones, I have not seen an 8 or a 9. And I'm not talking about how hot a girl is. <laughs> I'm talking about, you know, the glove ward numbers. Okay, let go. Hello? Hello? Pot boys? Pot? Hey! Hey! That was started though. You bitch! Come take a gander. Nope. I <laughs> got gotcha. you. I'm so awesome and amazing. Aha. Uh -huh. Yay! I... I dodged. Controller. What the hell? I got you! 
Creo que... Así es... Ajá, some more throwing ones. No. Probably an illusionary wall. There you go. Oh, a magical bomb. That was a little bit different. Okay. Any more traps? Aha, uh -huh. I knew it. Is this going to be another one of those? Yep. Of course they are. What are they? Where? Where will they take me? There's three of them now. Where are they going to take me? Aha, uh -huh, there's four of them now. Whoa! That's new. Ah! That's new. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. Okay, this is another chest that teleports me. God damn it. So uh, then then where am I supposed to go? There can't be this many chests. You know, leading up to the outside world, right? I think they teleport me in areas inside this place, right? I'm not crazy, right? So, because there is no other way to go. There's no ladders to go up. There's probably some illusory walls. Probably I missed some, but really... Eh, I just hope that they don't take me outside the dungeon. Let's just go. Teleport me! And snare. Nah, uh, transporter trap. Yeah. Aha! I knew it! I knew it! But do they respawn the enemies again? Oh man! They respawn the enemies? Ah, well, that's not nice. I mean, they're easy to kill. But, ah, oh, come on. Did not see you there. Okay. But what does... What the, what does this do? I've already been here before. There's nothing here. Okay. So... So this chest and that one all the way there from, to the pot boys they are connected to each other. I get it. But why? Why? Let me just... Do this. Where does this leave me? Ah, the other side of the thing. Okay. Are there going to be crabs? Pot boys? Yeah. Exploding ones, too. 
A cracked pot. Nice. Okay. Another cracked pot. Nice. Okay. Thank goodness that these don't lead me to the outside world, you know, the open world. Probably one of those chests do lead me to the open world, but uh, so far, so good. Aha! The lever and the glove wart 6, which I do not need. Wait a moment. Wait a moment. Wait. Wait a moment. Wait, no, I have not. Wait a moment. If that was the lever room. Then the other place with the other two gargoyles would I thought it was a dead end. What do they do? Oh, and the enemies don't spawn again. Okay, that's pretty nice. Okay. Okay, but where does this lead dead? To a whole other room? Because what I was thinking of was... Wait, where am I? Wait, what? Okay, I'm getting... Either I'm crazy... Or is the dungeon changing... As I play? Am I crazy? Because this wasn't here before. This was definitely not here before. And this is... Aha, the place of the pot boys. And if I go back... Does... does that do anything? Or does it... What? Wait a moment, I must be tripping. I must be. Either my memory has had a fart cloud, or I'm really just incompetent on my memory, or maybe the dungeon is actually changing form as I play. Let's try and get the other thing. Okay, so... Okay, so this is the other room where the gar gargoyles were. Oh! Alexa... No. I keep thinking it's Alexander when it's not Alexander. Fuck. Big boy! Ow! Big boy. Wait. This... This... This has to be... This has to be changing before my eyes because I've never seen this place before. I've never seen this area. So something is 
changing in the game. Yeah, because I already killed that guy before. I already did. And I killed those guys on top, which weren't there in the past. But now they are. Which... And there's no item at the other side of this. What? What? This is crazy. This is... This is... This side doesn't do anything. It's just the same side that I've seen before. This is fucking me up, man. <laughs> this is fucking me up because... Wow. There is a treasure chest that allows me to go to the other side of the other grave that was at the beginning. Not this one because this one I already explored. But then that one which was the same grave but it wasn't the same grave. Gate. The so... There's a lever now. So... If I go back... just one treasure chest so one of the treasures is connecting me to another side of the dungeon so there's two dungeons they're two look-alike dungeons okay that's my theory right now, and some of these chests put me in the other version of the dungeon. That's what I'm getting by this. Okay. Okay, so if I go down... And if I go... To either the pot boy chest because there's an item there that I cannot get okay I experimented with that one now I'm going to experiment with this one in this version Okay. Okay, see it changed. This is fucking me up. I don't know how to get to the other side of the grid. This is fucking me up. Oh my. Aha! There is no glove wart in this one. Okay. But it's still the same shit. <laughs> he just leads me to here again. With the other glove wart. With the one that has the glove wart. Okay. This is weird. This is very very strange and weird all right I give up <laughs> I'm going to the boss area I give up I'm trying to find the right chest for that thing I give up there's there's probably there's probably a chest uh, on the on the boss area, maybe. But right now, I <laughs> I don't care because I've been through that chest, this chest, the other chest, a whole bunch of chests, all kinds of breaths. You know what I mean? So I got tired. <laughs> I got tired of trying to figure it out. Let's go. 
Grave Warden Duelist. Hey, the shield bro protected me. And down you go. And the butt boys. Uh, soul jars of fortune ashes. Okay, pretty cool. Okay. Seems like. Uh, seems like uh, there's still something in here, and I don't know what. Don't I? I have no idea. No fucking clue. How to get the other item from the grate? But now that that's done, I'm going to Aurizia Hero's grave this time. Another one of the hard dungeons. This is pretty OP right here. This thing is pretty overpowered. Eliminates all FP consumption in mixed Sysic. So... And the Sysic lasts for a long time. Maybe the effects of it doesn't last for a long time, but... If it does, woo boy. And I already hear basilisks. Use stone sword key. Here we go. Aha, I see you. I see you. Ah, oh, you jumped at the first sign of trouble. How cute. If you only had your red googly eyes from the past. Golden epitaph. What? Ah, uh, straight sword. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 Oh, no. No. Not on one... Uh -huh. Not another one of these. God fuck. Ah, uh, God fuck me. This thing again. Come on, big boy. I know you want to parry me. Yep, oh, never mind. Why is there a light there? Why is there a light there? Whoa! That is not fair. That is unbelievably unfair. Uh, I hate these dungeons. Hate them. With all my soul. Okay. Let's... Why is there a light right there? Why?
Why? Okay, I could go down. I could go down. And spare me this... thing over here. Yeah, I should go down. I should. Because... There is no way there to... Oh, fuck. The stoners! You know, it, it's path is too short. Oh! Hey! You burrow on the ground just like a Dark Souls 2. Nice. That's pretty cool. Alright. Any other... Ah, <laughs> I love these guys. I love those guys. If they had the googly eyes from before, I would love them even more, but... They don't, so I don't love them as much. <laughs> Glove Ward 5. Eh. Still not something I can use. Hey! <laughs> that fucking asshole. Eh. I completely hate these maps. Completely. How the fuck? How the fuck? Am I supposed to do anything now? They're a little off of sync. A little. Okay, come at me. Like that. Okay. Woo! Damn it. They were uh, ah, there's a, there was a thing there. They were pincering me at the middle, and I did not know where to go. But, okay, let's do this again. Oh, there was another way over here. Ah, cool. Is there another way up? I am guessing, right? Okay. I made it here, but I guess this is the other place. The... Yeah, the... The place where I was before. God damn it. 
Uh, I was too... too focused on the other one. Fuck. Why is that an insta-kill? That doesn't make any sense. Ah, oh, fuck. What the fuck is this? What the f This is so stupid. This is so incredibly stupid. Motherfucker. I did it. I did it. For better or for worse. I did it for now. Ish. Okay. Mm, okay. Ah, oh, shit. One of them. More googly eyes! That was bullshit. That was extreme bullshit. Oh! Gotcha! The amount of stupidity that is present in this in this dungeon is insane. Ah, uh, vulgar militia ashes. That basilisk just got born, <laughs> and he died. Okay, this is probably the main way that I could have gone if I would have tolerated more of that bullshit. Right? Yeah. Well, no, not really. Not really. Okay, I'm going down because... Fuck that. I'm going to... The other place. Further down below. Where this thing is. Do not tell me that there is going to be a... Ah. What is this? Aha. Whoa! Between your legs! Okay, he's not gonna get me there. You okay? I thought I was gonna fall, but it seems not. Okay.
Ah, uh, let's keep on going. Let's go through this tom fuckery. I don't wanna... I don't wanna be... Aha! Another one of these! Aha! So... Uh, where should I go? Is there an alcove somewhere down there? Is there something up there? Oh, there is. Okay. That's not what I wanted to do. Can you, can you, can you go down a little bit? Can you... The light? Oh! What does that mean? Does that mean? Ah, no! Okay. So I need to de-summon it somehow because there's no light in there anymore. So Okay, there is another alcove over there. It was just a skeleton. How nice. Uh, what are could what 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 do I do now? There's no alcove down there. What? No, there's nothing down there. Are you serious? Okay, I don't know if I can go back. I don't know if I can anymore. Because something changed. The light from that motherfucker is gone. So... Maybe if I despawn it, it won't spawn anymore? I don't know if that's the answer, because I can't go up, there's no ladders to go up anymore. And that thing is still rampaging. So what can I do? There is nothing there. Right? This 
is crazy. This is it. This is just crazy. Okay. I'm going to bet my life on the line. I'm going to try and... Find something. Woo! Okay. There was something down here. Okay. But that was very close. Extremely close. Way too close. Okay. I hate these dungeons. I hate them. Completely hate them. I don't like them. Completely loathe them. What uh, what does this do? Ah. We just go this way first. Uh huh. Okay. Oh my! And honey, what are you doing? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Seems like that's all it does. Crucible Feather Talisman. Crucible Feather, huh? Improves dodge rolling but increases damage taking. Improves dodge rolling? What does that mean? Does it... Does it go to... From medium to light load or something like that? But damage taken. Yeah. I'd rather just trust my 99 endurance. <laughs> Wait a moment, is that true? Like... Ah. I'll, te I'll test it another time. But right now... I'm going up or down. Up! Okay. I'm going up. This is the... the top side. What does that mean? What does that light mean? What does it mean? I don't know. They're they still are here. Are you joking? What what am I what am I supposed to do? Ash of War, Holy Ground, Tree Sentinel Helm, 
Armor. Grapes. Oh. Oh. So. But that doesn't... So I could have gone here and then shoot that thing from here and then it'll be fine? But there were other things like the one over there. So why didn't that one die? Why? And I still haven't found the... Oh, yeah, I don't need it. I don't need the lever. I hope that this is the last one of these dungeons. The last kind of these dungeons. Because I can't take no more. Okay. All right. Okay. I'm a little bit winded, but I think I can do this. I think I can. I think I can. Whoa! I think I can't. Okay. This is it. This is evil. This is evil! Ah, I'm dead! <laughs> Fucking asshole. Hey! At least the... The shield bros are doing their job, but holy fuck! Two of them. Great. Got it. Okay, let's get it on. Let me get my soul. There you go. Shield bros, go! Ah.
Yeah! <laughs> From behind! The, the, the last shield, bro. Wow. Ordobis Greatsword. Crucible Axe Helm. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Woo! Second try. Not my first try, but the second try. <laughs> and the and the shield bro was the victor. <laughs> uh, well, that was cool. Very unique. <laughs> if I didn't have my shield helpers, I would be pairing and pairing and pairing and pairing and pairing and pairing a whole lot more. But fuck this place to the hells of the earth. Fuck it. Fuck it so hard. I don't want to see it ever again. Man, that was bullshit. How many uh, how many of those uh, spike statues have impaled me thus far? Uh, I don't want to know. Okay. So, now that that's done, I... Mm, yes. Now that that's done, I will go into Lindell. But first, before going into Lindell, I have to do... Uh, I have to go through... A uh, boss. An E3 boss, right? It was a... Uh, one of the E3 bosses or something like that. Okay, so Ordovis Greatsword it has holy on it. Eh, okay. Greatsword of Ordovis is one of the two honored as foremost among the Crucible Knights. This sword is imbued with an ancient holy essence. Its red tint exemplifies the nature of primordial gold, it's said to be close in nature to life itself. Ordovis Vortex, you, see, you mean that spinny doodaddy? Channel the power of the Crucible to spin the entire sword in mid-air, building momentum before slamming the blade to the ground. The skills can be charged to increase power. Let's try that. It looks nice. Looks, uh, looks very nice. Good, good. Okay. Not what I like, but okay. No thrusting attacks, which is bad. Okay. Okay. I mean, it's a cool ability, don't get me wrong. It's a cool ability. But, oh well. Let, let's see how I like it in the future. Probably when I do my bonus episodes, you know, exploring the place and whatnot, then I probably will try it. But for right now, I'm ending this episode because this... Uh, this hero's grave took way too much time, and I died a couple of times. One with the boss, and like three with the traps in there. I completely hate those traps. I hate them. Okay, next episode I'm going through here and then I'm going to visit the capital, Lindell. Not through here. No. Yes? Ah. Okay, I will defeat this boss, and then go through here to the Finger Reader Crone. Because there's two entra- three entrances, actually. This one, with the Divine Bridge. This one, which I haven't discovered yet. And then this one, the Capital Rampart. So there's three openings to this. But I think this leads to these parts of the castle, you know, the outer parts, I think. 
but I'm not going to worry about that right now. What I'm going to worry about is this thing right here on the next episode. Thank you everybody so much for watching this video and I hope to see you on the next one.